There isn't anyone who doesn't enjoy a fantastic cruise across the ocean. With the wind in your hair and the sound of rolling waves, most of us would do anything to secure ourselves a few days off on a grand cruise ship and immerse ourselves in total relaxation. What if there was a particular cruise ship that could provide you with the ultimate vacation, guaranteed to give you the best experience a cruise ship could ever present? And more, how much would you be willing to pay for this cruise trip? $500? 800 bucks? Sounds pretty negotiable, right? Now try $1.23 million. Yes, that's right. A cruise trip costs over $1 million. I know, a bit too over the top, wouldn't you say? In this video, we'll be talking about one of the most expensive and exciting cruise package deals that promise to cram in every available ounce of luxury for a price that could bring you as far as halfway around the globe. How luxurious is it? Is it as enjoyable as people say? Let's dive in. The company in charge of this highly costly package is Six Star Cruises. According to them, this extravagant trip consists of multiple nights at five-star hotels, including the addition of three ultra-luxury cruises. The journey would start in London on November 11th and end back in London on March 13th. It means that the whole trip would last for a total of 123 days, during which time it visits 41 ports spread over 11 different countries. Some of these places include a desert safari in Dubai, a tour around Lansau Island in Hong Kong, an exploration of Waitomo Caves and Hobbiton in New Zealand, a helicopter tour of Mount Fuji in Japan, and a whole lot more. Providing aspirational packages and cruise holidays is part of what Six Star Cruises is all about says Managing Director Allison Earnshaw on Travel Daily Media. The recent demand for luxurious holidays, including cruises such as expeditions and world cruises, just proves the longing for indulgent breaks, and this $1 million package deal showcases that perfectly. What about the cruise ships themselves? Based on a confident ocean liner of one of these ships, it is the most luxurious ship ever constructed. For the detailed version, here it is. According to Regent Seven Seas Cruises, guests will be staying in the Regent Suite aboard the 750 passenger Seven Seas Grandeur, which they will operate. It measures almost 4,500 square feet in size and costs around $11,000 per night, based on double occupancy. Guests would enter the Regent Suite through a square Italian marble archway, entering an expensive living room or dining room area with a faux fireplace with bronze flame. In addition, the separate parlor area is outfitted with twin chase loungers for naps and stargazing at night. Finally, the 1,227 square foot wraparound balcony overlooks the ship's bow and has its tressy mini pool. Not luxurious enough? Here's more. Two significant restaurants open for lunch and six open in the evening. Items like caviar and lobster are featured prominently throughout all restaurants' menus. According to Forbes, a standard 14-night voyage aboard the Explorer results in the consumption of around 2,000 pounds of lobster. In addition, the ship has a culinary arts center where passengers may attend lessons to improve their cooking skills. Fortunately, cooking isn't the only lesson you're able to attain. There's a fitness facility on board and a running track that goes around the deck. Talk about running with an ocean view. In addition to Pilates and yoga lessons, visitors will be able to keep themselves busy by playing shuffleboard, putting greens, golf nets, bock courts, and paddle tennis. In addition, there's a library, a posh theater for after-dinner plays, a casino for those looking for some after-dinner amusement, and finally, the luxurious area has its spa, a wide wraparound patio with a mini pool, expansive living and eating space, and a skylit parlor with an ocean view. For the Regent Suite, they are just as, if not more luxurious than the ship itself. Each of the ship's 375 rooms is a suite, and each suite has its private balcony. Following that, observers of the boat may notice the suite's redesigning and its reflection of modern aesthetic preferences, which is a lovely touch. Pampered guests will have the opportunity to indulge in unlimited complimentary spa services, including an in-suite sauna. In addition, the company has reimagined the suite's primary bedroom with a luxurious four-poster bed outfitted with an ultra-luxurious Hostens Vavitas mattress and a custom-made patterned mirror art panel 
crowning the head of the bed. The suite, which can sleep six, also has a second bedroom with a private bath and a guest half bathroom. Finally, the presence of Picassos in the guest rooms will be apparent with enormous crystal chandeliers at every turn, approximately 500 of them, and crockery designed by Versace. In addition, clients staying in the Regent suite also get first-class airfare and have access to a personal vehicle complete with a driver and a guide, which is waiting for them at each port. Furthermore, they get access to the ship's private dining area, known as the Study, which situates between its steakhouse, Prime 7, and French restaurant, Chartreuse, and may even use it to conduct their dinner parties. Another fantastic and unique feature of this cruise package is that the suites themselves won't be the only place to stay for guests. Some additions to the dreamy private tours in this package also include luxurious rests at the Burj Al Arab, located in Dubai, the Ritz Carlton in Hong Kong, and even the Sofitel Viaduct Harbor in Auckland. You may even celebrate New Year's Eve by spending time on the private balcony of a rooftop suite at the Park Hayat Hotel and viewing fireworks over the Sydney Harbour Bridge. Although they have announced that the Region 7 Seas Grandeur is supposed to make its debut much later in November 2023, with premiere seasons in the Mediterranean and the Caribbean, there is still much anticipation as people await its eventual appearance. That's all we've got for the fantastic and sophisticated six-star cruise package deal. What are all your thoughts on it? Is it luxurious enough or perhaps the luxuriousness is too much to handle? Make sure to comment your opinions below. We'd love to hear from you. And if you liked the video, be sure to smash the like button to show some love. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and hit that bell icon to never miss any updates from us. Until the following video, take care and stay tuned. I found you.